is going to be in my makeup collection. I am so excited to share with you all of the makeup that I have acquired um, really n over not that long amount of time. Um, just a forewarning, my makeup collection is not as large as a lot of makeup collection videos out there, so this buddy right here is not super full, but for what it's worth, I really love everything that I have, and I hope you guys all enjoy this video! So, the first thing that you're going to see is my vanity, and it is actually a thrift store purchase. I got it at Habitat for Humanity's Restore, and I painted it, sanded it down, just changed it up a bit, and this this is how it came out. The chair is from Home Goods, I believe, and I think it's Cynthia Rowley. And I just really, really like it. It doesn't fit in the little cubby hole for the chair, but that's okay. I don't mind. Um, the makeup storage is the Alex by IKEA. The lamp that I have is also a thrift store find or an antique small or something. I don't know. I got it for like $20 and just um, cleaned it up a little bit, bought a new lampshade. And then the frames are from Ikea and the pictures that are in the frames are actually just scrapbook paper. So here's a close up of the top of my vanity. Again, there's my lamp. My little mirror is one of those reversible kinds. It has like 10 times magnifying or something. I don't know. And it is from Home Goods, I believe. The little jar with the cotton balls is also from Home Goods. We're not going to go ahead and judge how dirty my makeup brushes are, but um, all of the holders are from IKEA. They're actually, um, the square ones are vases, and the circular ones are like tea light holders or votive holders. This first little holder is just full of all of my different eyeliners that I have. So we have some Lorac eyeliners, we've got a NYX jumbo eye pencil, some Sephora, and then some Anastasia brow pens. Um, we've got a uh, Too Faced Three Way, don't really use that that much, Kat Von D, just a bunch of different brands there. This one is just full of my various eye makeup brushes. Um, there's a couple eyebrow brushes and then also a lip brush that is currently stained by an OCC lip tar. Um, you don't belong there. And most of my brushes are crown brush. All the pink ones are crown brush. And then most of the other ones are the Sephora Professional line. The brushes that are in these square vases are um, just various face brushes. Again, they are crown brush. And then whatever is not crown brush for the most part is the Sephora Professional line. I think there's a couple bare mineral ones stuck in there um, that just kind of somehow found their way there. For my first tour we have got all of my foundations, concealers, pressed powders, primers, things like that. I tend to organize my makeup in my storage unit from the top down with like what I use first and then so on and so forth. So we have got um, some foundations right here. We have the CoverGirl 3-in-1, a Garnier BB cream, the Revlon Nearly Naked, a um, Bare Minerals powder, my Crown Brush Illuminating Foundation, I absolutely love this. I'm also really loving the Kat Von D Foundation right now, which is really great. Um, and then I've got some primers in the back. And then up front, we have got all of my concealers. So we have a Kat Von D Tattoo Concealer, the new NYX Pencil, um, a couple different shades of Kat Von D Foundation, just for like touch up. A Conceal FX and then the Benefit Perk Up Artist. Um, and then some reason my moisturizer just found a home right here. It's the Ole Hendrickson Truth Serum or Truth Cream or whatever. And I really like that. Um, and then back here is just my pressed powders. So I mainly Lorac. I have a couple different shades of Lorac pressed powder and then a Conceal. No? What are you? Bare Minerals, Illuminating, Translucent, something, and then a Matte FX, which is just the um, Conceal FX brand pressed powder. Okay, so my second drawer down is all of my bronzers, blushes, and highlighters. So, um, mainly the bronzers that I have been using has been the Sephora bronzer in the color Los Cabos. And then I also have been using the Smashbox bronzer, which is in Halo. And it's actually really cool because it's got like 
this grinder on it and you grind it and it just makes like a powder really like that um, as far as blushes go most of them are cargo um, Louisiana I've got a Malfi which I really love it's this gorgeous like Barbie pink color um, we also have got Echo Beach which is great for if you're running late because it's got the bronzer already in it and then um, I have got the Key Largo, which is my favorite. It's like this pinkish coral color that's just absolutely beautiful. Perfect for summer. Um, I also have got some cream. I've got NYX and Sephora cream blushes. And then this is like Beauty Babe or something. Be a Bombshell Cosmetics and Sweet Cheeks. I got this in Ipsy or Birchbox, one of the two. Um, as far as highlighters go, I have got my Bare Minerals Illuminizing Mineral Veil. I have got a Bare Minerals Ready Powder in um, The Love Affair. This color is really, really pretty. And I just hit pan, if you can see that right there. And then um, a little tiny sample of the High Beam. And then I also have a Cargo um, Stick Highlighter, which I really like. The third drawer is all of my loose shadows. Um, so I have got all of my Sephora. I have got a NARS Duo, a Bare Minerals. This was in a couple tutorial Tuesdays ago, and it is the palette The Truth. And I used that in a tutorial. Um, my Lorac Liquid Luster, I absolutely love this. Um, all of my mascaras that I'm currently using, some primers. And this is my brow gel. And then in the back, I just have a bunch of Bare Minerals, um, like, pigments. And then all of my color tattoos are right here. A random Stila eyeshadow. And then my liquid liner that I just got from Tarte. And the next drawer down is all of my palettes and some lashes and things like that. The palettes that I have, we have the Naked 2, um, my Lorac Pro palette, we have got a Smashbox, I believe it's Be Discovered palette, um, a Sephora Moon palette, um, my Kat Von D color palette, I love this, it has the brightest, prettiest colors in it, um, my Stila, what are you called, In The Moment palette, that was in my last Tutorial Tuesday. I also have got my Anastasia Brow Kit, um, what's below you, another Smashbox palette. On the very bottom is the Sephora and Pantone giant palette that I do have for a giveaway. I'm um, almost ready to do that giveaway drawing. And then my newest palette, which is the Aqua Lilies for Tarte. I absolutely love this. I've played with it a little bit and it's so pretty. And then I've just got some lashes, my contacts, some duo um, eyelash glue in the dark tone. And that is this drawer. My last drawer as far as makeup goes is just my lip gloss drawer and it has got some Lorac glosses, um, some Revlon Just Fit and Kissable Balm stains, some Revlon lip butters, um, my Buxom, it also has some OCC Lip Tar, some Stila lip glosses are over here, um, another Buxom lip gloss, I love this purple color, um, a Stila lip stain, and then some random drugstore ones that I don't really use that much, and then in the back I just have a couple little lip balms and then some lip liners. I tend to lose my lip glosses, so this drawer is not very full because I probably have like 30 of them at work in random places, I don't know. And the next drawer, I just have my hair appliances in. So I've got my um, hair dryer, my cheese straightener, a three barrel curling iron, and a curling wand. Um, I have got the quick dry brush, which I hate. I got this from, um, an influencer box, the holiday box box. I don't really like that. The next drawer down is just some hair products. So I've got um, hair ties and headbands and bobby pins and my new teasing brush, 
Um, good old generic swab hairspray, not your mother's beat the heat. And then I've got some cheese stuff in the back, um, some big sexy hair, uh, volumizing powder, things like that in this drawer. In the next drawer down, I have got some random samples that I have not gotten to use yet. Um, and some lotions and some random things. My brush holder for my crown brush. So that was my makeup collection. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Until next time, don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. Also check me out on all my social media sites. It's Katie Does Fashion, KT The Letters Does Fashion. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye everyone, love you.